Hello everyone, Foxlow back again with part 10 of my X3 series and as you can see I'm enjoying the sight of my nemesis flying in space. <laughs> um, yeah, I've now obviously brought the nemesis here, um, those who have been watching the series. In the last series we got the disintegrator guns and we're now going to the hub. We're going to jump to the hub, we need to fly to the Xenon hub. But we can actually hopefully jump. I haven't tried it, so this will be first. Because uh, I've got a jump drive, I've got 88 energy cells, so that should get us there. You just press Shift and J, and that will give you the option to find where you want to jump to. Now, Xenon Hub is there. We're in, so when we go there, it's Xenon Hub. And we, it will ask you which gate you want to go into. So, as it's a normal gate, we can jump to it. So let's just go to that one. Jump device charging. Here we go. 10%. Cool. 20, Quick way of getting there. 30. But like 40, I said in previous, in, you can't do this 60, at the accelerator 70, um, 80, gates, 90, only at a normal gate. Jumping. Now I don't know if I've got the right ship for the job. Entering oh! Xenon hub. Right, bye. Here we go. They're all small fighters. They're M. I think oh, you got one M3 there, two M3s, M4s, and a couple of M5s. The M5s are going to be the difficult ones to shoot, but we can ram them. <laughs> With our shield, we can ram the small ships if we can get close to them. So we've got. Yeah, I don't think I would have survived if I used a scorpion in this lot. Definitely not. But now it's going to be hard to hit them because they're a lot faster. Um, let's put, shall we, no, no, let's keep it at two guns only first. Let's see one which, which comes closest. Dukes, this one. Pericles. That's the closest one, so Target let's. Target is now in firing range. <laughs> so you're going to ram him. Dukes, Pericles. Can you ram have him. lost recognition. Yeah, with Duke. Who gives the monkeys about Duke? See, he's too far away now. Hoping my up gun will do some damage. No, I don't think I would have survived this with the scorpion. He goes sideways on. Well, I'm giving you some compliments, mate. You know? <laughs> I have got a missile, but I don't think it's much cop. Have I? No, I haven't. But I'm strafing while I'm doing this, so the others that are shooting me hopefully will miss. Like I'm missing this one. See how fast they are. I can never get them. Wait for my shields to come up. See, my shields are on... 75% right now and I'm not hitting this sod let's maybe do two guns three, three guns See, they should actually hit him but we're not hitting him where's some of these Oh, it's that one that's firing at us. Let's ram some of these if we can. Compliments. So I can't keep my guns on him because he's so quick. That slowed him down a bit. Ah, come on, get on him. I'll watch my shields now down at half. <coughs> Duke's Pegasus. So we've got to destroy that as well. 
Uh, I can't get on him. Now, if, that, that, if they had that flame weapon, it would destroy my shield. I don't think many of them have got them. Come on, someone's got it. My shield's down to <clears throat> a bit low. That's my upper gun got one. Just keep firing. <laughs> oh, I love it. See, this is an M3, so they're easier to hit. Who's firing at me? Oh, that's my gun firing at it. Or maybe we're getting help, look. Are we getting help? There's a lot in here. Let's go to that one. Yeah, somebody else is helping, which is cool. Incoming message. Oh, it's one of my ships. Was missile. I don't want the wasp missile. Target left firing range. Let's take one of these. Let's take the M3, which Dukes is that one. Perseus. Yeah, it's an M3. They're easier to kill. Come on, shield, get up. Target oh. is now in fire. I've lost range. half my shielding. We're not hitting him at all. There we go. You are being promoted, Gate. Those smaller ships have got PBEs, which have uh, got a high fire rate. Come on, get onto him. Dukes, Perseus. Let's hope the others kill the smaller ones. No, I want this one, not the one that I've, um, that one. He's probably behind me, isn't he? <coughs> I want this one. Come on. Could have swore I had missiles. <coughs> oh, sell them. Resources are incoming message. Target is now in firing range. Yeah, right, I've got some selling to do probably. There we go. <laughs> That's it, make some more money even while I'm playing. <laughs> Wee! Ram him. Ram him. Missile. And there's more, look, there's more, there's so many. Dukes, Pegasus. No, I want to take out the bigger one, not the little ones. Let's go for. Incoming message. That one. Dukes, Pericles. You'll shoot your dolphin. Oh, wait a minute, that's not the one. We're in, we'll fight our way to the control tower. Now, prevent the Duke ships from docking at the hub and sending in backup forces. Okay, oh cool. We've killed enough to get them to come in to grab the hub. So let's keep, let's see, these are just going to be flying out, I think. Now all we'll have is a normal spawn of um, pirates, I would think. Oh, my shields are back up to normal, cool. That was cool. But the guns, these guns are too slow for the faster ships, as you've noticed. My aiming is not that bad, but it's not 100%. Come on, we need to get close to these, this is so slow. 
No, I was at the stage now where I'd done all the um, missions and it's all free for me to do what I want. I will be upgrading all the speeds of my ships. This needs to do at least 250, not 135. So yeah, I'll cheat a little bit. <laughs> but that's once I've dealt with the uh, vanilla side of the game. Oh, um. Oh, it's taking so long to get there, and he's going at 200 odd um, kilometers a second, a little bit quick. If I get their attention, then they can attack me if they come head on. <coughs> it's a bit easier with the bigger ships, because you can ram them. <laughs> as long as you watch your shielding. No, I'm not getting any closer, look how long it's taking me. Now, taking on 4 or 5 with a Scorpion is a bit dicey. Because of its shielding. Target is now in firing range. Yeah, but it's the wrong firing range. Let's go that blue. See the travel time for these these particular rail guns is not quick enough. Target left firing range. And some of them should have hit when it's not. Nah, we're not gonna get Target these. Target is now in firing range. Yeah, but look where he is. No, it's just too, too fast. Ah, where is he? I haven't hit him once. Maybe let's try all guns. <coughs> If I get lucky. Attention, energy low. Yeah, it's the trouble. Using all the guns. Let's change that option to semi. <coughs> but to semi, um, I don't know. No, it's not gonna work. Attention, energy low. <coughs> this is taking us ages. Attention, energy low. <coughs> Let's see if I do any better with the mouse, I doubt it, but... Let's go on. You see that? That. Attention, energy low. <laughs> Wasting me time here, ain't I? near him. See that? It's, you've got to go in front of him there. If I can ram one of these, uh, get close to that one. See, they're concentrating on him. Yeah, don't get the side.
Duke's Pegasus. too quick. We can come on head on. It'll be a lot better. Did I hit him? No, don't think so. <gasps> oh yeah, I think I just glanced him with one shot. Oh, this is hopeless. That little one surviving a long time, isn't he? <laughs> with having all these four on him. Protect gate hub. Destroy Duke's pericles. Ah, oh, hard, yeah. Target Duke. left firing range. Pegasus. Duke's pericles. <laughs> the one that wants us to destroy him. He's saying hard. <clears throat> it definitely is hard. I wonder if I should bring the scorpion in. Ah. I think I got him. Yeah, I'm trying to, trying to. Well, I got him one, one hit. Oh. Let's get the scorpion in here. Command accepted. <clears throat> Be a while before he gets here. See, I can get the scorpion to attack as well. Hopefully, I don't lose it. Wait. Yeah, come and attack that. Oh, he's gone. Wildfire oh. missile. No, I don't want the missile. I want you. you Duke's go. Pegasus. He's far too quick for me. He's going at 400, look. Target left firing range. Oh, this is fire. Target Randomly. Is now in firing range. Wait. Oh, this is the wrong ship for these small ones. Unless they're actually attacking us. Come on, blow it up. Come on, fella, blow it up. Blow it up. None are hitting. Come on, blow that little sod up. Target, <coughs> target is now in firing range. Target left firing range. <laughs> Target is now in firing range. Target left firing range. Yeah, they're just too quick. Too quick and slow. Uh, s <coughs> small. And I've got no missiles. If I had some hurricane missiles, I could kill him. Take a while, guys, isn't it? <coughs> Come on, get here, Scorpion. <laughs> Initially, this was the right choice, but um, trying to kill these small ones with the uh, Nemesis is uh, a bit of a pain, especially with the guns I've got on. If I had all caps on, the caps, <coughs> the packs, I mean, particle accelerator cannons, we could probably hit them because they're. Uh, the speed of the uh, particles are quicker, but that little one's definitely surviving, isn't he? Him. Target is now in firing <coughs> range. Oh, so cool! Come on, get on him! Did I hit him again? Ah. 
because he changes his direction so quick even though I've got the blue on the reticle look some of the shots should hit but they're not because he keeps changing his direction wait yeah wrong ship I really need missiles Oh, I got him. I got him at last. Lucky shot. Ah. Go sideways on. Whoa. Yeah, come shoot at me. I'll ram you, come on. <coughs> Wait. Could have had him there. See how he keeps turning his nose. So I can't get a bead on him. Bummer. So he's going to crash into me. Keep firing. <coughs> I don't hit the friendly. That would be something, wouldn't it? Wait, don't get near. Oh, shook, 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 shook. Don't get near the end. Let's get out of the way. Hmm. <coughs> it won't update until they're dead. And we're close to the side of the hub. Target left fire ah. range. Oh, you know, we're so close to the hub here, look. Let's get out of the way. Destroy our oh, ones died. Target is now in firing range. Wait. Oh, I got him with one look. See the small ships? So hard to hit. With this weaponry. Yeah, come on, fellas, kill him. Because <laughs> I can't. Wait, I'm frightened of hitting the hub. That will do me some damage. Yeah, crashing into it, I mean. Not hitting it with fire. Wait. Oh, one of those shots must connect. Oh, sugar, did I shoot him? I hope not. <laughs> so he's still shooting all the others instead of coming towards me. If he came towards me, he'd be dead because I'm ramming. Yeah, he's using PVEs. Their fire rate is quite quick. 
No, I'm not going to tin there. At last! Oh, friggin' hell. So I don't need, need this scorpion. <laughs> That's... Incoming message. Mission complete. Oh, what's happened here? The hub's not ours yet. I knew it. I knew you would betray us when we met at the supposedly dest at the supposedly destroyed pirate base. Who did you team up with? The pirates, the pyranid, what did you what did they promise you? Some illegal goods or their latest calculations? It doesn't matter. Our reform reinforcements will be here soon. And then your little revolution will be over. Oh dear. You still have time to make the right choice and support the path to real power. The Duke is always looking for people like you, someone who can decide to make a real difference. Don't be afraid of what the Duke might do. Welcome it instead. He is sure to shower you with unimaginable treasures. We know how the hub works and we know what you are going to do next. We have sent you a gate sequence that will connect the gate to a sector that the Duke considers convenient. Transmit it to the pyramid inside the hub. Then not only will your life be spared, but the Duke will also grant you a high rank position within his organization. Oh, okay. But no, I'm not going to do that. I don't know what to do next. <laughs> um, oh, okay, that's telling us what to do next. Talk to Holony. Target the hub. Gate hub. I haven't got a clue what's going to happen now. So the Duke's after my bug. Oh. <laughs> Let's get a bit closer. Come on. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Cool but hard with this thing. What is that? Is that some goodies? Wasp missile. Oh yeah, wasp Gate missile. Hub. Let's do the comm first. Well, if we can pick that up, because um, it'll, if it's out in space for too long, it'll just blow up and disappear after a time. Yeah, in a minute. That's it. Comms. You are talking to the automated interaction system. What do you require? Actually, I'm working with Ikman Kardet and some other friends of mine who should reach the control chamber soon. I know. I, I listened in on them for the intercom. But once they reach the chamber, I fear they will not only betray each other, but also you. I have sealed the doors, but that will not stop them for long. What do you suggest we do? I have located a possible gate to connect the hub to. It is within Bourne territory. What happens when you connect the hub to it? I will send an emergency call to the Bourne fleet. If they pick up the signal and have ships around, they should jump in and secure the whole hub. There are a lot of ifs. So, what shall I do? Connect the hub as you suggest. Yeah, connect the hub as you suggest. I like the Borons. Go. Incoming message. Mission complete. That wasn't me. Just as I was powering up the hub again, it re-established this one and only Incoming gate. Incoming message. Connection before shutting itself down. The hub must have saved the connection data or somewhere. But wait, there's still some energy left. Let me try activating the third gate pair as well. Okay, what's the next message? Pilot, you have performed well for a lesser creature. The Emperor Tsar of Paranidia is mildly impressed with your actions in dealing with the unholy Duke. Cathedral of the Fates is under our control now. Mm, for now, and connection to Paranid space has been re-established, allowing transit for all. Unholy one, you may go on your way now and enjoy the blessing of the Emperor Tsar in your travels. May the light guide you, Roger. Achievement unlock, Nexus incident. Oh, is that the end of it? That's normally the end. So that's it, but we didn't get the hub. Didn't get the hub for ourselves. I thought that's what would happen. 
How many gates are open? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, all the gates are open. Going everywhere. Oh, cool. Um, but we didn't get the hub. I thought the hub would become yours. Maybe. Um, that, oh, yeah. The hub's plot is going to be um, within X3 anyway. So you'll get that later on. Because I'm assuming it's going to follow now on. Yeah. We've now got to discover all those other areas. So let's see where those gates are. Holy Vision, Holy Vision, the Void Alpha, Shore of Infinity, Perpetual Sun and Lucky Planets are oh, cool. Where should we go first? Shall we go uh, Holy Vision we've just been there. Yes. The Void Alpha, Shore of Infinity. Why is that got three there? Epsilon, Holy Vision Alpha. Let's go Shore of Infinity and have a look see, shall we? Why not? Gate Shore of Infinity. Oh look, Scorpion gets here, look. A bit late, fella. <laughs> um, let's just check that up. Oh, I want to see what's on the hub first. Gate Hub. This installation was constructed long ago by a technologically advanced race. It has since been damaged in a conflict with the Xenon. The installation acts as a hub for three sets of gates, rerouting existing gate connections. Okay. So I'm assuming... Maybe I did that all wrong, I don't know. There might have been two different ways to get it, but... That's the X... Uh, FL done I think now let's do that again let's apparently juice war on weapons dealer Talady scavenger okay right let's go where we were going to go shore of infinity gate shore of infinity and start discovering where are we where are you there we go let's go and have a look <coughs> there we go, little Scorpius following us now. He can easily keep up, can't he? Hmm, <coughs> <coughs> interesting. That's it, that's it's finished. There's possibly I might actually play another play myself and see if there's a different option with a different ending hmm could be could be more than one quite possible don't hit nothing go through the gate go through the gate am I lined up properly I think so no too high now down a bit and we can watch ourselves go through the gate and that should make it hopefully not upside down thanks <coughs> well that was fun that it really was fun hard because you know <laughs> wrong guns on this ship to fight small uh, fighters definitely wrong but M3s and other M6s, yes, yeah, fine. But not for M4s and M5s. <gasps> Can't hit them with these guns. Yeah, don't you crash on me, Scorpy. Don't want to lose you just yet. I've got attached to my Scorpy and I have. <gasps> Am I going to get through? Yeah, I'm lined up okay. I'm sure. Double check. Yeah, we'll get through. I really like this view. I like just watching the ship. So that's taken... Whoa, don't crash into me, Bobby. Don't crash into me. That's taken 10 episodes. This is episode 10, yes. 
to get to this point. Not bad, actually. Incoming message. Well, that's probably one of my ships. Entering shore of infinity. Cool. Discovered a new system. What's my message? Pilot, after reviewing your actions, the Emperor's art of Paranidia has decided to entrust you with the control of the Cathedral of the Gates. May the wisdom of the Xar and the Holy Light guide you in your path. Oh, it's given me the hub. Is the hub mine now? Well, look at that. It does give it to you. Cool. We got the hub, guys. So we can, al mm, I can't remember how, how you do it, but you can align gates to whichever sector you want. You can actually, you should be able to change them, but we're not going to do that right now. We've got the hub, so that's cool. I just want to have a look in here. There's no discoveries at the moment. The uh, um, icon hasn't changed. So nothing new that we can discover in here. Now, let's have a look at the map. Shore of Infinity. We've got a lot of discoveries to do, guys. <laughs> Now to get back to there, we can we can't jump. That's the only problem with that. The void area you can't jump to. We can only jump to the hub and then go in through the hub. Because they're all acceleration gates. Oh this is cool, we've got loads to discover now. Let's just carry on. I'll use the scorpion now because that's quicker. Um yeah, that was fun guys. Um I hope you enjoyed that run through. I'm not gonna stop this video yet. Um, we'll see what it's like. I'm waiting for the Scorpio to meet. Is he in? Oh, are you here, Scorpio? Yes, you are. Right, let's... Stop. Where's Scorpio? Let's highlight him. Scorpion. Oh. Advance. Change ship. There we go. A bit, a bit quicker. Oh, we're upside down. Look. <gasps> Cool, what we got in this particular system? Let's have a look. Oil ball and trading titan. Nothing much. The space stations of the Boron are unpleasant due to the heavy ammonia content of their atmosphere. Despite that, many different races frequently use them, as the Boron are not only members of the Foundation Guild, but also benefit from established trade agreements with the Teladi and Paranid. Now, what I need to find is somewhere where I can buy um, salvage insurance from. But, um, I don't know. Let's get him to keep on following us. Nemesis. Ah! <laughs> Orders, follow me. Command accepted. I know he's going to be way behind, but at least he's, he's always going to be there at some stage. Um, hmm. Bit foggy here. Let's discover all the gates, shall we? Nah, go up. And we discover that one. Is there one over there? Yeah, there's one over there. Hmm. What's the gate behind us? Is it south or east? East and north gate. Oh, we've come through the east gate. So that's the north gate we found. Does it have a south gate here? <laughs> Can't see it there. That doesn't mean there isn't one. Could be off, off the centre. I have to get a map and look at the map to be sure. <gasps> West gate, okay. So you've got three gates now, I think. Yeah. Now where does that lead to? Gate Preacher's Refuge. Okay. Let's go through it, shall we? Hmm. Paranoid Military Heavy Nemesis. Now basically it's the um, X3T 
Tehran conflict. I'm presuming that's what this will be. Um, hoping that all the missions and the plots are the same as they used to be. But you have to find them. I can't remember where they all are now. But we've got to map all the systems now. Let's see what's here. Entering Preacher's Refuge. Creatures Refuge, what have we got here now? That's a pyramid dock. Yeah, this is another pyramid sector, but that sector behind us was uh, Boron. Chip plant, chip plant, light shield, oh, light shield production, let's have a look. Is it, have they got one this MJ shield? Oh, he's got one MJ shield, and five MJ. Oh, great stuff. We'll go and grab one straight away. <laughs> right, let's target you then. We got Light shield production complex alpha. Oh, we got freebie here somewhere. Let's have a look. See what that is. What that discovery is. Be nice if it was an M3 fighter. <laughs> it's probably another um, journal, isn't it? Oh look, that's probably what it is, journal. Is it, see uh, that there? I don't know if that will be it, because the uh, arrow is not telling us to go there. Got to be that. No, it's telling us to go to the right. What is that then? Paranid civilian ship. Ah, civilian ship. <laughs> We're getting close to whatever this is. And we're nearly on it. It's got to be a journal. I'm hoping it's something Hyper different. Speed access point. Oh! Another one. We need to get relay satellites then. Hmm. Cool. So this is all new. So um, yeah, it's going to be all different, I think. What's that over there? Is it moving? Yeah, it's moving. It's probably a little ship. <laughs> okay, we found somewhere new. Another hyperspeed access point. So we need three um, relay satellites. There, see? Can't always deactivate it. Yet. See where that will take us. Hyperspeed access point. Cool. Another discovery made. But let's first get our shields up. We can sort this out. And I've got to remember that it's in Preacher's Refuge. Oh, well, cool. Now, where was the... Uh, there we go. Light shield production target. Light shield production complex. Alpha. Oh! I bought a docking computer as well on this ship so we can dock straight away. When we get close. Granted. Autopilot activated. When we get close. Now let's tell um, Nemi to stop doing what he's doing, otherwise he's going to try and dock. Command accepted. And then tell him to follow afterwards when we get going. I'm enjoying this, I really am guys, it's a um, bit of nostalgia as well, but I can't remember half of this stuff, it's such a long time, but we'll get there. Right, get within five kilometres and hit shift D again and we'll automatically dock. There we go. In the name of Priest Emperor Czar, our Priest Duke welcomes all friends of the Paranid aboard. Connection to local trading network established. 
Oh, good. I've got a, a little bit of money to buy too. Five megajoule shield installed. And the ship has got four. Oh, wait Small a minute. Small fighters and scout ships typically use no, a one megajoule shield. Shields are vital. Mm. I'll keep those four and put it back on the discoverer so we can use the, dis tubes. the discoverer to do some um, discovering. Um, let's put the shields on. Um, how do I put the shields on again? <laughs> why? Let's go Y. Right. Five MJ shield them out. Hmm. I can't remember how you put them on, friggin' hell. No, not that one. Weapons, yeah, five, pay one. Oh, it's automatically put them on, that's cool. It's got the five MJs on. So we've got slightly better shielding for him, which is cool. Okay. Let's do a save. Uh, <coughs> relays. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, we can make them, can't we? Hold on. Let's have a look. See my Hermes hauler? There, look. I didn't know we had that. The Hermes is based on a design for the original Ganymede, but the old design was reworked to accommodate passengers. Like most Paranid ships, it can carry a certain amount of weaponry, primarily for defense. Hmm. Oh yeah, I discovered it. I don't know how I got it. No idea. Attention! Sector tour flight 641 will take off in 10 Missouri. Repeat, sector to a flight, six, four. Right, select blueprint. Let's see, can we make them? Relay beacon, there we go. Um, do we have enough stuff to make it with? Hold on. Blueprint. Oh, I need some credits, okay. Um, I want to make three though. Um, credits, let's give it a hundred K. Just type 100 in. That didn't work, did it? <laughs> oh God, I'm going to have to do it like this. I have to work out how to do this. <coughs> I don't end up putting too much in because I ain't got much. 120k. Well, that's a long way around doing it. I'll work it out eventually. I just can't remember. Right, let's just do that. Then. Funds transferred. So we can make the relay beacon. We need to have three. Oh, oh, it's made one already. Relay beacon, make another one, got enough dosh? Yeah, 2,000 it needs. Relay beacon, make two. Incoming ship, now docking crews to stand by. Presumably it's making them. Found abandoned. Little is known about this large, unique station nor about its previous owner or owners. It does, however, bear some resemblance to They're other specialized it. stations that have been built at various times by successful entrepreneurs for use as headquarters. The advanced design of the station suggests... Yeah. <laughs> Can't turn that off, I don't think. Um, I'm thinking what to do now. Let's have a think. Um, let's do a save. That'll be an idea. 
and have a look at what are the other stations here. Oh, that was so nice finishing it. I didn't think that would finish and we got the uh, hub. Um, let's go and have a look at the hub. Um, see what we need because it's, it's not going to be straightforward to change. Not that we're going to now because we've got nowhere to change it to. I've got no idea because we haven't discovered any of the systems yet so we can't really Audio change it. Off. Let's get back to it. Why is that marked up? Oh yeah, that's for the uh, relay beacons. Um, we're leaving Emmy here. Let's go back to the hub. So it's on the east gate, wasn't it? Yeah. Let's start. Oh, there are ships. Target the east gate. Gate, shore of infinity. Up there. Let's go and have a look at what the hub can do for us, if anything. Oh, that's 51 minutes in and then I'll call this one the next video obviously is going to be I'm going to I'm going to do a quite a bit off camera after this to try and um, sort out what I need to do and then come back to you with um oh who's shooting at who <laughs> you often hear that there's um action fighting each other Entering shore of infinity. Was, was it north? Where's the hub? Oh, there we go. Oh, it's east. So where's the east go? Well, right in front of us. <gasps> right, let's go quick. Oh, look at that! I love it. Oh, that's a new ship. I've never seen that before. Is it a ship? Oh, that's cool. What is that? Let's have a look. I've not seen that shit before. I bet mean, that's Ariad expensive. Military Ariadne. Oh, that's cool. But that costs a bit. Following the trend of employing drone carriers in Border Patrol duty, a strategy established by the Argon with their successful Griffon prototype, the Paranid Empire issued an order for a drone frigate design of their own. Superior nice. to the early Griffon variants in every way, the current Ariadne, the result of several months of corporate espionage and outright plagiarism, <laughs> is indeed a vastly improved version of the Argon prototype. Nice. Looks so cool. So they must have new ships in the game as well. Nice. Right, where was I going? East. <coughs> to the hub. To the hub we go. I didn't think I'd have it because... Seen on hub. Um, like I said, when it happened, maybe I'd gone the wrong story mode, but we've got it. I don't think we can do anything with it right now, but we're going to go and find out. And I've got some decent shielding. Well, for this type of craft anyway. It'll still go down reasonably quick though. <laughs> Entering oh, freaking hell. Hub. Oh look, there's an M6 there. I'm not gonna be able to fight that. Right, let's get on the hub quick. Get away from him. <laughs> Gate hub. Get within 5k's and just hit shifty. Successfully docked. Okay. Welcome back on board. Connection to local trading network established. Anybody here that I'm going to talk to? No. Adjust station parameters. Okay, let's see what we've got. Um, Banshee Michelle, Parker, that's not on me. That's on me, that is fighter drone. Can I do anything with it? I don't know, advance. Oh, there's no option to do the gates. This service is a time limit. Um. The hmm. credits that this factory made by selling. 
So, sector control, let's see what that is. Oh, you can claim a sector. Oh, gate realignment, there we go. Select the hub gate you wish to realign. Requirements for link gates. Needed energy cells, 10,000. Time on to the next realignment. Gates available, none. There's none to realign, so we can't realign it then. Hmm. Don't know if there's a way to do that then. Display monitor, maybe you can't. Maybe you've just got to accept the fact that they're done now. Sex the control. Achievement unlocked. All your sectors are belong to us. What? What? <laughs> Incoming message. Don't know why I'm in there. I've got a sector belonging to us. Let's have a look. Um, what's the message? HQ the production queue is empty. Okay, close. They've made it. Um, God knows what happened there. I've obviously got this sector as mine, is it? It's going to be green because um, I'm there. But if it's my sector when I go out and it's still green, is it my sector? Hmm. Let's see if there's anything in my message log. Wait. Achievement or not, all your sectors are belong to us. So that's a bit weird, isn't it? <laughs> all your sector are belong to us. Doesn't really make much English, does it? After you actually know, uh, hmm. Yeah, I'll have to look into that. Anyway, guys, um, I've got a lot to think about and do at the moment, um, so I'm going to call it here. And we've got through the um, X3FL system, so that part of it is finished, but the game isn't, obviously. So, I thank you so much if you got this far with me. And I will catch you whatever is in my next one. So thanks for watching. See you soon.